ASPCA and police raid on a house in East Belfast in November 2011. An ordinary terrace house with a not so ordinary backyard. It's packed with cages, some empty, but many of them with dogs, some just a few days old. Heavily marked and it's gone. There were concerns about marks on some of the mature animals. Today, the occupier of this house, Jeremiah Kirkwood, seen here on the right with his hood pulled over his face, his son Wayne, who's with him, and another son, Chris, pleaded guilty to having or training animals for fighting. Now, for the first time, we can tell you just why the police raided the Kirkwood's home. Sometime before it, police officers searching a house found a mobile phone. When they examined videos recorded on that phone, they were shocked. We're going to show you some of those recordings now, but we would warn you again, they are very distressing. A cat, probably a pet, caged. It has no way to escape as a dog is set on it. In moments, it is pulled from the cage. The rest of the pictures are simply too graphic to show. In total, four dogs were allowed at the cat, which remained alive for some time. A man shakes a tree to dislodge a cat, again, probably a pet. As soon as it hits the ground, two dogs are on it. Again, the rest of the sequence is too disturbing to show, and the result is the same. We showed the MP for East Belfast a slightly longer version of the pictures we have broadcast this evening. Naomi Long has an established interest in pet welfare issues and first raised the issue of domestic pets going missing in the area over a year ago. To see people's pets effectively being torn limb from limb while they're still alive, it's just, it's obscene and barbaric. Unfortunately, we've not been able to identify who the cats belong to, but it would appear the cats were being trapped and then used for the dogs to, to train them. Uh, in preparation for animal fighting. When USPCA officers examined the video, they quickly came to believe that what was going on went beyond cruelty. They felt that the cats were being killed in order to blood young dogs for other so-called blood sports, such as badger baby. The images that I saw were certainly the worst I have ever seen. Um, there, there is nothing to compare with this. This is premeditated. Uh, the animal was totally defenseless. The cruelty was completely unnecessary. Uh, and this was done purely for the enjoyment and for the supposed skill uh, of people uh, trying to demonstrate their dogs. All four guilty men will be sentenced next month. Gordon Adair, BBC Newsline, Belfast.